The Roman Empire had a long history of good fortune in finding the right man at the right time. Scipio, Augustus, Aurelian and others had appeared at opportune times to use their skills to bring victory and or peace. In the early 5th century, Rome needed such a man, and once more fortune shone upon her in the form of Flavius Constantius. He had risen through the ranks to become the foremost general of Honorius by 411, and for the next decade he defeated numerous usurpers and barbarians. He was rewarded with three consulships, marriage to Honorius' sister Galla Placidia, and elevation to co-emperor in 421. However, the newly enthroned Constantius III did not see this as a reward. He regretted his elevation, but he no longer had the freedom to leave and go off wherever and whatever manner he wished, and could not enjoy the pastimes which he had been accustomed to enjoy. Much to the dismay of the Western Roman provinces, Constantius III died just seven months after his imperial elevation. Had Rome's good fortune run out?